Assalamu alaikum guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. Today I've got a tutorial for you in English and in Urdu and this is another Eid look but it's a slightly more heavier glam than what I did last time. So in the last video I showed you a very simple everyday look uh, which can be used for Eid as well but this time I've gone a little bit heavier. So it's a smoky eye and then I added some glitter at the end so you can see how they both looked. So I just got to do Eid Glam hair last time I had a simple sa Eid Glam kiya tha aaj thoda sa heavier kiya smoky brown eye and then end pe maine glitter add kiya tha so dono aap dekh rahe hain ki kaise lag rahe hain to shuru humne kiya eyebrow se jaise main normally karti hu so yahan pe maine thoda sa apna eye shadow hi use kar rahi hu and apna eye sa eye sa bas thoda sa brows ko fill karke shape leke aa rahi hu so i started off and i'm all i'm doing is using an eye shadow a brown eye shadow a matte eye shadow with an angled brush and i'm just filling in the brows very very slightly where i think i need to fill them in and then i'm just going to comb them through and then i'm going to go around with my concealer and carve it out so here i'm just using the um benefit brow wax um which isn't as um it doesn't hold as much as the be perfect that i tend to use so this just literally gives you a little bit more fluffiness um and not too um you know not they don't look as as rigid or anything like that so i've put on the powder first and then i'm adding this on so it just brushes everything through and it gives it a good blend then i'm going in with my p louise base as normal again you can use foundation here you can use any concealer that you want as well and i'm just going to carve out the eyebrows and i'm going to go on the whole lid this time last time i only um, went on the lid a little bit um because we're actually going for a slightly heavier eye here so i'm covering the whole lid and then i'm going to carve out the eyebrows on the top as well and blend that out so last time maine kam product use kiya tha yahan pe maine abhi obviously um apna base use kar rahi hu peel hui iska agar aap chahe yahan pe concealer use kar le foundation use kar le and apne isko carve out kar lena apne brows brows ko and eye base ki tarah use karna hai and then jo baaki ka product hai usko aap sara kuch blend kar de यहाँ पे मैं अभी एक डार्क ब्राउन लूँगी एंड ये मेरा एक फ्लैट ब्रश ले रही हूँ एंड इसको आई बेस के ऊपर लगाऊंगी सो यहाँ पे मैं लगा रही हूँ टैपिंग मोशन से लगा रही हूँ कोई स्वाइप नहीं कर रही क्योंकि प्रोडक्ट नीचे वेट है एंड यहाँ पे मैं लगाती रहूँगी जब तक मैं मुझे अच्छा लग रहा है कि जो जो कलर का डेप्थ मुझे चाहिए एंड इसको शेप में ही रखूँगी हम बहुत ज़्यादा हाई भी नहीं लेके जाऊँगी so initially i've started off with my p louise and uh, wedding wish palette so any matte brown color that you want to use so i've gone for a dark one i'm using like a flat brush and i'm tapping the color on cuz the product underneath is actually wet i've not set it with a powder so i'm just going to tap the color on until i'm happy with the depth of color that i've got and what i'm doing is is just tapping it on again and again until i'm happy and i'm keeping the shape that i want as well so i'm just using the brush to actually help me um get the shape that i want and i'm literally keeping it to the eyelids and i don't want to take it too much higher than this so you're just going to carry on doing this until you're actually happy so the 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 reason i'm doing this is basically is just to get the depth of color So once you've got your depth of color you're going to go in with a slightly um lighter color than what you used before. You can use different colors here but I'm going for a brown smoky eye so I've gone for like an orangey brown now. And now what I'm going to do is use like a slightly fluffier brush and I'm going to overlap the first color. 50% is on there and 50% is actually on um the rest of the eye and I'm just going to blend this out in the same shape that I'm going. You can see that I'm actually keeping it a little bit rounded this time instead of taking it quite sharp like i normally do and you're just going to continue doing this and this takes time so you have to keep going over this and really blending it out so a light brown color liya 50% um jo mere brown color pe hai and then 50% rest of the eye ke upar hai and wo hi shape rakh ke to usko main blend ki ja rahi hu to yahan pe aapko thoda sa time lagega isko blend karne ke liye to yahan pe time laga ke isko blend karte rahe फिर जो आउटर कॉर्नर्स आप देखें ये जो एरिया है इसको अब मैंने ब्लेंड करना है तो थोड़ा सा मैंने फ्लफी ब्रश लेके जो आउटर एरिया जो है उसको ब्लेंड कर रही हूँ सो देन यू जस्ट गो बैक इन विद अनदर ब्रश एंड द सेम कलर एंड वो आई डन इज जस्ट ब्लेंडेड आउट द हार्श एजेस दैट वे एट द टॉप एट द ट्रांजेशन कलर एंड देन बिकॉज वीव डन ऑल दैट ब्लेंडिंग ऑब्वियसली इट डज टेक आउट सम ऑफ द the डेप्थ ऑफ कलर दैट यू इनिशली वेंट इन विद सो आई ऑलवेज गो ओवर ऑन द लिड्स अगेन विद माई डार्क कलर I've added um, a little bit of a, a black eyeliner, going with my skincare, which is my hyaluronic um, serum. Then I'm going in with a bit of eye cream, and then I'm going to go in with my moisturizer. 
So, hyaluronic serum and is the malkia, thorsa eye cream use kia and thorsa moisturizer, junivia cream hair, nothing um, expensive. And then I'm using my blur, blurring pore filler to use um, from e.l.f. Again, I, I've not actually put the products down today, but, um, but these are the products I normally use. And in the um, when I put my uh, the rest of my tutorials up, I will have all my products. But this, for you, to be honest with you, it's, it's a case of you can use the same products I've used, or if you want, you can just use your own products as well. So I'm color correcting um, with a slightly darker shade of a foundation from my Makeup Forever palette. And I'm just going over all the areas. I didn't color correct last time, and so that's why you can see there's a huge difference between this makeup and the one I did um, a few days ago. So if you want to check out that tutorial, you can do as well. And because I didn't color correct like this, there is a difference to, you know, the amount of color that's showing through and things like that. So there is a reason why we do, do all these steps. I've gone in with the same foundation that I used as well, but I've gone in heavier this time. So this is the Revolution IRL foundation. And I absolutely love this foundation. I think it's absolutely amazing. So color correcting kiya and then foundation use kiya. Now last time I have not done that because I didn't do color correcting. And in this makeup mein and the last Eid makeup jo look kiya tha, jo bilkul simple tha, bahut zyada farak hai coverage mein, foundation mein, um, jo obviously jo um, dark darkness hoti hai, jo thoda sa agar grey ho jata hai, kyunki obviously apne color correcting sahi tarah nahi ki. I have wahan pe sir simple jo everyday wala makeup hota hai, kyunki usme मैं कभी भी कलर करेक्टिंग नहीं करती सो बस एक दिखाने के लिए कि क्या डिफरेंस आ जाता है कलर करेक्टिंग नहीं करें किसी और तरीके से मेकअप करें कि कैसे कैसे मेकअप ओबियसली चेंज हो सकता है फाउंडेशन वही यूज कर रही हूं जो लास्ट वीडियो में यूज की थी ये रेवोल्यूशन की आईआरएल फाउंडेशन है जो बहुत ज्यादा मुझे अच्छी लग रही है फुल कवरेज है लेकिन इसको अगर ओबियसली अगर आप कम भी लगाना चाहते हैं कम भी लगा सकते हैं so I'm just applying this um, with my brush first and then I'm going to use a damp beauty blender and blend this out. So I've gone heavier. Last time I used my fingers to blend out the product and this time I'm going slightly heavier. It just goes to show that obviously just the way you apply things makes such a big difference as well. Um, so you can apply them according to how you want them. You don't have to go as heavy as I've gone or someone else has gone. Um, or it just depends what kind of look you want to achieve. So I'm applying a damp beauty blender with a little blending here, and then concealer use. Carry on concealer. My Tarte hai. So I'm uh, Tarte concealer use. Carry on here under the eyes. Carry on here. So I'm using my Tarte concealer to just highlight underneath the eyes and then center of the face, which is like down the nose, and then you know the chin area and the forehead area. So I'm just using a brush to blend this out. Now I have been using Beauty Blender before, but actually lately I'm actually preferring to blend out my concealer with a brush. Um, I just think it's, it's you get a slightly uh, fuller coverage this way and um, it blends out a lot nicer. So um, you'll probably notice me using my brushes more than my Beauty Blender now. I'm going to set this with a bit of powder. So I'm just using my MAC Studio Fix um, powder just to set um, underneath the eyes. Um, where I need that setting before I actually go in and do a little bit of baking. So concealer, I have set with the brush. I use beauty blender so much. I don't use it. I use my brushes because I feel it's good. And then the under eye area, I have set with the MAC Studio Fix powder. I have set with the MAC Studio Fix And then I have set with the powder that I have set with the contour palette. I use it with the contour palette. I use it with so I'm just contouring with my um, Gashi's um, contour palette. Any contour palette that you've got or, you know, if you want to use a bronzer, you can use a bronzer. So it just depends what kind of look you're going for. So again, I wasn't going to go too heavy with the contouring. So I have blended that out. And then I'm just using a smaller fluffy brush to go down the nose as well. Again, I'm not contouring overly heavy here. I am baking a little bit. But not too much. The whole point of this powder was really to catch the fallout from any of the eyeshadow that I'm going to use underneath the eyes. So I wasn't going to go for a really heavy bake, um, baking under the eyes or anything like that. Had a beauty ka loose powder use kiya yahan pe baking ka maksad nahi tha yahan pe maksad ye tha ki jo yahan pe main dark colors use karungi to unka jo bhi fallout hoga usko main fir catch kar sakti hu aur aasani ho jati hai thoda sa saaf karne ke liye. So here I have added a black and then I will add a brown mix with fluffy brush and then I will add a blending. So I have gone in with a black first and then I am going in with a slightly fluffier brush with a darker brown colour and really blending that all out. 
सो so, यहाँ पे मैंने ब्लैक ऐड कर दिया एंड देन एक छोटा फ्लफी ब्रश यूज़ करके एंड देन ब्राउन ऐड कर दिया एंड अभी जो मेरा पाउडर है उस सार सबको हटा रही हूँ ब्रश की मदद से सो एम यूजिंग अ ब्रश टू एक्चुअली गेट विड ऑफ द पाउडर ना यू कैन सी आई एक्चुअली डिड हैव सम फोला एंड द कलर वज क्वाइट डार्क सो आई हैव टू गो एंड क्लीन दैट एंड इट वुड क्लीन विद द पाउडर दिस टाइम सो आई डिड गो इन विद अ लिटल बेट ऑफ कंसीलर एंड देन क्लीन इट अप दैट वे एंड इट वर्क दैट वे इवन दो आई डो रेडी पाउडर अ बेट So you just have to persevere and carry on, um, and it does um, work out in the end. So here, I'm a little bit obviously fallout was more than that, and the color was quite dark, and it was not hard at all. So here, I put a little bit of concealer with the brush, and I blended it with the brush, and then I put a powder on it, and everything was clean again. So these mistakes happen. I didn't cut it obviously, I couldn't cut it. Um, लेकिन मैंने छोड़ दिया ऑबियसली कि आप लोग देख लें दैन थोड़ा सा आई लैशेज लगाए हैं एंड देन जो आई लैश का जो बैंड होता है थोड़ा सा हल्का सा वहाँ पर आई लाइनर लगाया एंड देन लिपस्टिक सो आई जस्ट गॉन एट इज द आई लैशेज एंड देन वर आई डन इज जस्ट गॉन एवर विद माई लिक्विड लाइनर विच इज़ फ्राम एन वाई एक्स इज अ लिक्विड पेन एंड आई जस्ट यूज दैट एंड हेयर आई एम यूजिंग दिस इज ए लिपस्टिक फ्राम फेंटी ब्यूटी इट्स आई कॉन्ट मेम द शेड एम अफ्रेड बट एम इट्स अ रियली रियली नाइस um liquid lipstick so i've gone on with that and i'm just going to obviously just um make sure i've got that right um then i did go on to add a bit of glitter so i thought i'd show you that so this is the final look with no glitter and then i went in and added some glitter as well so i'll show you that in a second so yeah mara look at just smoky look uh, without glitter so aap aise bhi is look ko um rakh sakte hain bahut pyari lag rahi thi mashallah and then thoda sa humne socha ke thoda sa glitter laga ke aapko bhi dikha dete hain so ye maine aaj glitter use kiya hai um, press glitter hai so iske liye koi glue wagaira nahi chahiye hoti ye palette mein aise aata hai ye bahut zyada milte hain gold sa color hai and uh, isko maine finger se hi apply kiya hai so aap dekhen ki kitna aasani se um, ho jata hai to iska koi fall out nahi hota So I've used my finger and I'm use and I'm applying my press glitter. So these press glitters don't need any glue or anything. There's so many of these about now that you can buy. This one is actually from With Love Cosmetics. And I'm all I'm doing is using my finger to actually apply this. But I am you can go obviously a lot heavier with this as well, but what I'm trying to do is get it heavy on the lid and then blend it out as it goes upwards a little bit. And it makes makes a huge difference. So this is how I've just added this glitter so you can add less like I've done there. or you can just go back in and obviously go heavy and heavier so it's completely up to you what kind of look you're doing so i just thought i'd show you the two different looks let me know in the comments below whether you liked it with or without the glitter as well so our comments mein mujhe bata dena ki aapko glitter ke saath pasand aaya ya without glitter pasand aaya and then i'm just making sure i go over and tidy everything up so this was pretty much the full look i've got the final look for you in a second I have got a lot of uh, English and Urdu tutorials coming soon so please do subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment below and inshallah I have a lot more coming next week as well now so keep an eye out for my tutorials so yeah hamara final look tha apni dua mein yaad rakhna eid mubarak sabko and inshallah dobara mulaqat hogi allah hafiz